Oh, God. What's going on here? Wait. I can use that bow. See if this thing still works. Just remember Roth's training. You can have the best form and technique in the world, but it won't mean a thing if you can't focus. The key to using any weapon is focus. So hungry. I need to find something to eat. always have some fancy gadget to tell you where you are. If you can learn to read the land and the stars, you'll always be able to find your way home. Conrad Roth, captain of the Endurance. We are shipwrecked on an island inside the Dragon's Triangle. Roth! Lara! You're alive! Easy, easy. Are you okay? What happened? I remember the beach, and then it went black, and I woke up in a cave. There was this crazy man, Roth, and a dead body. Oh, God. Where are you now, Lara? Are you safe? It was so horrible. It's all my fault. This is all my fault. Lara, listen to me. I sent an SOS from the Endurance before I abandoned her. Hopefully someone caught it. I've spoken to the others. We're regrouping at my location. Please come and get me. I have to stay here. You can do this, Lara. Remember when we climbed Snowden? You said the key was knowing that all you've got to do is just keep, keep moving. moving. Remember everything I've taught you, Lara. You're ready for this. And keep your radio on. Okay. Music.
Hello? Is someone there? This could be a way through. No mask represents a hateful woman in the guise of a demon. There are traces of white paint on the inside. Whoever used this mask was of noble birth. Follow the path. It's a bit of a climb. Did you get that? Got it. We have a fire. Look for the smoke. We're on our way. Laura, you made it. Sam. Um, Thank goodness. Surprise. It's okay. He's one of us. Sorry if I startled you. This place would make anyone a little jumpy. We just spoke to your crew. They're on their way. Look, he bandaged my foot. <laughs> oh, it was the least I could do. My manners. I'm sorry, I'm Matthias. A teacher by trade. Not really cut out for island life, I'm afraid. <laughs> Sweetie, you look exhausted. Sit down. Yeah. Sam here was just telling me about the Sun Queen. Right. Himiko. Can you tell me more? I'm intrigued. Well, believe it or not, a couple thousand years ago, Queen Himiko pretty much ran things in Japan. <sighs> she loves telling this story. Himiko was beautiful, enigmatic, but also ruthless and powerful. Legend says she had shamanistic powers. And this is where she loses me. Well, there's always some truth to myths. She commanded an army of samurai warriors, her magnificent storm guard. They rode the very winds into battle, laying waste to all who opposed them. They say the sun rose at Himiko's command, and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea 
and beyond. <gasps> but what happened to you? She was with you. She was here with that man, Matthias. But I passed out. When I woke up, they were both gone. You can shoot Nico one time off. We need to find them. No, uh, wait, wait, wait. What about Rock? Okay, let's split up. One of us go with Lara and meet up with Rock. The rest of us should fan out and look for Sam. I'll go with her. No, no. Let, uh, let me. You know how to use one of these? It's, it's been a while. It's all coming back to me. Get to Roth. We'll find Sam and this Matthias guy. <laughs> you gonna be okay? Yes, I probably just need to rest for a few minutes. <sighs> you sit, uh, you sit here. I'll, uh... <clears throat> I'll check up ahead. Okay. Not so bad. I can't believe we're actually on an expedition to find the homeland of my ancestors. Ever since I told Lara the story of Himiko years ago, she's been hunting for its location. I never really gave it much thought. That any of this could actually be real history. My grandmother used to tell me the story like it was a memory. Many thousands of years ago, Queen Himiko ruled the land of Yamatai. The sun rose at Himiko's command and she ruled everything its rays touched, from the mountains to the sea and beyond. But one day, Yamatai simply disappeared without a trace. Forgotten in time.
could have warned me about the wolves, Doctor. It's all clear, Laura. Come on up. These are fascinating. I've seen these before. Oh? They must be ritualistic. This, this female image is particularly interesting. Looks like it was made quite recently. It's by those islanders, no doubt. Judging by the wrecks out there, they were once like us. Survivors. <laughs> Remarkable. Yes, well, let's hope we don't become murderers, too. See if you can work the other one. Handle's missing. Together. Oh, shit. It won't take the force. I'll have to find something sturdier to turn it with. Must be something around here we can use. Incredible. There's something really interesting happening on this island, Laura. I don't know if I call it interesting. What do you make of the symbols? Sun pictograms? Some primitive stick figures? Hard to say. This could be a sign of some kind of cult worship. Or it could just as easily be cultural graffiti. <sighs> I'll continue examining this. You should find a way to repair that axe so we can get this gate open. Darling, think. Think before filing those papers. I've, I've sunk the last of my fortune into this expedition, but it's all going to come back tenfold. If, if you divorce me now, you won't see a penny of it. You've been with me since I was nothing. You know what I'm capable of achieving. I, I haven't lost my touch. I'm just at a low point right now, don't you see? I'm on to something here. Laura, you remember her, my, my young protege. She has real data to back up her theories, but she doesn't have my savvy. It's going to be my name on the Discovery and my face in front of the cameras. If this all pans out, the show will be huge. If you want to leave me then, I, I promise I won't fight you. But please, just wait on it. I, I can't have this kind of publicity muddling my image. Please. Some kind of sun worship?